Hello, ladies and gentlemen of the internet. Leon Doran here, giving you a let's play of a indie game I discovered called At Atom Zombie Smasher by Blendo Games. I've had a few goes at this before, it's a hard game to describe, but also in terms of difficulty, it is rather unforgiving, but fortunately, there are a few modifiers that we can put to make things slightly more in our favour. We're just going for a normal 6,000 point victory limit this time, nothing too fancy. What we want is the ability to spend scientists to purchase llama bombs. Um, it's quite good to be able to customise your mercenary lineup every month, rather than just getting left with a load of shit. And the, the ability to have one offensive unit every week, no matter what happens. So, anything else we can put here? No, that should be perfectly fine. Right, let's rock and roll. Blendo Games presents... Nuevo Sales, 1960. Who the hell names their dog Gubo? What on earth's going on with that poor man's arm? Eh, we've all done worse in college. Right. The entire game's filled with these sort of little comic book-esque things. Very good. Okay, um, every week we get... Well, every month we get a modifier. So, we have today Aurora Stralis. Shorter daytimes, which is a real pain in the arse. You can see the world map here, yellow territory is one that we own and we earn 20 points towards our total every week with that. Here is a zombie infestation, a level 1, as you can see from the little purple diamond with a 1 in it. Not that hard to figure, figure out. Alright. Reward mercenaries, population 125. Let's go to Shao Ipisoma. We only have one mercenary available to us right now, and that is the evacuation helicopter. Our mission objective here, top right, is 10 chappies rescued out of a total of 125. So I'm thinking we place the first zone here. And let's get over with it. We're on a very tight schedule due to the fact we have 30 seconds, a much shorter time than usual before night time comes. Once the night comes, you can see the zombies are spawning from here. During night, they spawn from every single place imaginable. So, we've got to be quick unless we want to be up to our titties and zombies. Right over here. One of the main things about this game is you can't really save everybody unless you're very, very good. It's all about damage control. See? Fuck the chaps up here and oh god, it's night time already. Come on, just every man for himself, run for your lives. Oh, that wasn't the best of moves, it just cut off all those guys. Fuck it. There. At least we can save these two, maybe. Don't run towards the zombies, you fool. Oh. God, what was your mother drinking whilst you were born? Oh, come here. Yeah, never mind. Well, it's sort of a victory. Bronze medal. Damn. Two off silver as well. This is our victory point track. Each circle means a different thing. I'm not going to explain them all right now. We'll get to them when we get to them. Uh huh, and we have a new mercenary. Oh, thank God it's the good ones. These are little infantry assault ground units, which just mince through zombies like sausage meat. Slap my signature down and. Let's get ready to rock again. 
Shorter daytime again, less Z. This is less zombies this time, but is nothing to be sniffed at. Two exactly the same places. I prefer Costa Rimende. Even though Costa means coast and that doesn't appear to be anywhere near the coast. If my Spanish serves me right. Alright, we'll have chaps stationed here, I'll try and evacuate all this area. Meanwhile, we'll try and get the chaps from here, and the troops can keep the zombies away from these blokes here. All those zombies are significantly faster than what I believed. Come on. Bad die, you purple bastards. Well, oh, bugger. They taught you how to shoot you in the cells. In fact, get over here. Here. Four seconds before night time falls. Oh, you guys are so shitted. Come on, we need eight more people. I'm so bad at this game. Even on the easy mode, I'm getting my ass kicked. Soldiers, move out. Bad cover remaining civilians. In fact, we're not going to manage to make that. You get here. At least we can try and rescue people. Do not head towards the zombies. What is the matter with people from this nation? Jesus. Where are you going? Oh well, seriously, if you're that stupid, your death is a benefit to mankind, quite frankly. Bye bye! 48, another bronze medal. Yeah. I told you I wasn't very good at this. Landmines. Now I'm a happy boy. Oh, thank God. Things are finally back in my favour. Long daytimes. You can't argue with long daytimes. Alright. Zombies will be coming through here, I guess. Place the troops here to block off this bit. We'll delay these ones a while and hopefully we can kill most of these ones with the one mines. Boom! Au revoir! Things might actually be going in my favour this time. That's right, you step on that landmine. Good zombie. Come on, come on. If you manage to kill all the zombies before night time first strikes, you take over the territory. And that's an extra 20 points to your total at the end of every week. So we have 45 seconds left. Come on, boys. <laughs> Victory. It almost makes up for getting my arse kicked all those times. Oop, and an upgrade. Arrival time, 5.6 seconds. So that's good for me. That was me blowing the raspberry towards the zombies. Territory captured. Ah. 
Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think it is probably best that we end this on a high note. And that will be me signing off for now. I hope to catch you again soon. Good